Hi, in this video we'll be looking at how to use the update query in Microsoft Access and uh, <clears throat> we're working with our items table here and we're going to go to create then we're going to choose query design and we're going to add our items table and close by default if we look at the query type here on the ribbon we'd realize it's select we have to change that to update uh, this icon here with a little pencil and the exclamation sign uh, click on that and we'll now notice that our design grid has changed so you now have a update to um, row that has been added here let's say we wanted to update let me look at my items table again the price of bread okay want to change that from 50 to maybe 80 dollars or something okay so we can go ahead and look for item number and we're going to change the price so we have to add that here as well so item number we're working with let's see again is 0, 0, a good so i'm going to put that here in terms of our criteria on the item number so that's 0, 0, a and i want to update the unit price so in my update to row under unit price I'm going to add 80 because I want to update the actual unit price to $80 so if I should go to under query tools here design click on run you now notice that this little icon pops up ask you or letting you know you're about to update one row do you want to do it in this case it's intentional so we're going to click on yes if this was an error obviously no <laughs> alright so let's click on yes and uh, <clears throat> you can go back to our table here and notice that the price for uh, bread has been updated it was fifty dollars before and it's now eighty dollars hope this video helped you and if it did or if it does then please remember to click on the like button and um, you can always leave a comment and also subscribe thank you for watching